Selena Gomez isn't holding back. The pop star spoke out to Rolling Stone recently while promoting her upcoming documentary Selena Gomez, My Mind and Me, and she got candid about a variety of topics, including revealing that, while she wants to have children, that two of her bipolar medications make it unlikely that she could carry her own, saying, quote, that's a very big, big present thing in my life, and also saying, quote, however I'm meant to have them, I will. The Lose You to Love Me songstress also looked back on 2018, when she suffered an episode of psychosis that led her to being in a treatment facility, where she, according to the article, quote, spent several months suspended in paranoia, unable to trust anyone. The article says Selena was on various medications after going into psychosis, which left her, quote, gone, adding, there was no part of me that was there anymore. Subsequently, she found a new psychiatrist who took her off some of the medications, which caused her to detox, revealing, quote, I had to learn how to remember certain words. I would forget where I was when we were talking. It took a lot of hard work for me to A, accept that I was bipolar, but B, learn how to deal with it because it wasn't going to go away. Selena's new documentary hits Apple TV Plus on November 4th. Access Hollywood's Zuri Hall spoke with Selena at the premiere of the film and the former Wizards of Waverly Place star shared about what she feared most in her darkest moments. I think I was scared of myself. The way I was treating myself, the way I was talking about my body, it breaks my heart to, to think that's who I was. And it was really heartbreaking for me to know that I hope I never, I just don't want anyone to feel what I feel or has walked through. I feel like you, this can't, not be an emotional <laughs> carpet for you. What are you feeling right now and why? I'm very nervous. Um, this has been exciting, but a little overwhelming to be honest. I think I am still like a little shaky, but I'm excited to be here and I'm happy that it's gonna be released, so. 